This is what I eat in a day to fuel me for my first half marathon. If you've been following along the past couple months, you know I've been looking forward to this moment for a long time and it's finally here. Pre-run, I honestly wasn't that hungry, but I knew I needed some fuel in me, so I curb stomped half a Met RX bar to give me the energy I needed. Right when I hopped in line, I just felt so grateful to be there. I knew I gave it my all this summer, so as soon as the buzzer went off, it was time to have some fun. When I signed up for this half marathon, I wanted to run an hour and 30 minutes. That was kind of my dream goal, but I didn't know if I could do it. But as soon as I got to mile five, I realized I was having the best run of my life. For the last eight miles, I started flying. Once I got to mile 10, nothing was going to stop me from getting that hour and a half, and I pushed, and I did it. I ended up top 50 out of over 1,400 runners and third in my age group. The last three miles of this run, I was in a lot of pain. But then I realized how blessed I am with a body that works and is able to go run and feel pain after a good workout. A lot of people don't get that. And so while I have my health, I'm going to give it my all. And that's what I did today. After the race, I ate a lot of food, drank a lot of electrolytes, and spent time with family who came into town to support me today.